Hello everybody, this is Mr. DSI Review. Today I'm going to be reviewing another 200 point application. This one is called Army Defender by Cowlink. It's actually quite a good 200 point game. There's, um, it's held kind of like in the Brain Age style, like a book. This screen will, well, right here it's got a cool little image, and here, play records options help. Options is pretty much which hand you're using. And, um, play records is high scores. Play is, is a tutorial, quite a nice one, beginner, an expert. Expert's actually not all that hard once you get used to it. I mean, after like a round or two of beginner, you could probably move on to expert. It's just more mayhem. Anyway, for the sake of the video though, I'm just gonna do beginner. Basically, you control this turret here. The turret goes in two colors, red or green. And it fires a bunch of bullets. You click on the screen and it'll shoot wherever you want them to. Right now all the enemies are down there, so I'm pretty much shooting in the same spot. But you can make it shoot there or there or there. Uh, it's best not to do that though because over here it's like a combo and the more you have on the combo the more points you'll get. Every once in a while this will drop in some cool weapon. A little blue ship. Don't shoot that because that's on your side. You want that. Over there is your score. Time you have to go through. And there is your, it's like a rage meter. I think that's what they called it. Basically when it's full you get a nuclear explosion and at the end of each level um, there are various upgrades you can get and one of them makes it so you have um, so the rage meter is like split so basically instead of having to fill the whole thing up you'll get one nuclear explosion like this when it's only halfway full and then you'll still have enough for another one if you filled it all the way and later you can have three and probably more even so yeah it's a pretty fun game actually uh, it's a little bit uncomfortable to hold to switch the turret you use pretty much any other button L or R would, would work best except that the DSi has very crappy L and R buttons here, these upgrades are continues, um, or basically extra lives if you die, lose all your health. More bullets, which means instead of shooting like four bullets or whatever it is, it'll actually fire five every time you tap somewhere. And that, of course, is the rage upgrade I was talking about. And it goes on. As you can see on this side, there's going to be a whole lot of other stuff we'll see. It's actually a very good game. Uh, not too much more I can say about it. But, except for the fact that it, for 200 points, it's very good. It seems that a lot of 200 point games are very good, addictive little mini games. The graphics on this, I like them a lot. The gameplay, pretty unique. Um, kind of reminds me of that one, one of those mini games in Phantom Hourglass, the Legend of Zelda game, where you shoot the bow and arrow at the targets going on this screen. Um, Anyway, the sounds, they got, they got good sounds too. This game is great. You, I really recommend it. So, yeah, there's my review. If you liked it, please rate, comment, subscribe. I'll see you guys next time.